All right, it's Rufex in the gold and black. Fourth place game. All right, sports reach in the navy blue with the white pants. I got enough MPT to get here, take on Rufex. All right, it's the start of the fourth place game. We're back on the red Marucci field, 325 down the lines, 365 of the gaps, 385 to center. We start with a hit by pitch. Player is four fans. Everybody else is in the stadium watching the winner's bracket final. We're back here at the fourth place game. Knowing that that one's being covered, Arliss Miller walks to lead things off. All right, it's a two-hitter Jeremy Fry. Runner on first, Arliss Miller. Pitching is Justin Bobo Ogletree. Popped up using the stadium ZN ball. Camphor, I think that's Joey Camphor makes the catch. All right, it's Tyler Irvine from Competitive Edge and Sun Coast came over to Rufex this year with sponsor Mark Patterson. Won the home run title two years ago in conference. Dagmar Pena returns to Sports Reach at third. Joel Sanchez he used to play for Sports Reach a long time ago. And short middleman is Jeff Keske. Ogletree on the mound, Roncobaldo at second, and Tyler Kalki at first. Kind of a merge between Sports Reach, Precision, and SE. Donsky popped it up. Trying to get a feel for the wind. It's not very heavy. It's caught by Kesky in the middle. All right, it's Terry Lambright at the plate. 75 degrees. Beautiful day here. Wind blowing at nine miles an hour. Let's call it towards left field. And Terry Lambright uses a little wind into the parking lot, off the pole on the other side of the parking lot. See Spencer Sangster now with Rufex, Mark Patterson, as well as one of the managers of the year last year, Mike Yoder. It's Brian Honeycutt, he also came over with Irvine, Rogers, and Lundensky. Over here to the Rufex squad. Rufex, of course, won the double A last year. They move up to major this year. And he cut walks on three pitches. Kyle Center came over from Chick fil A. He doubles down the left field line, runners on second and third. Pass Sanchez going to score two. It's Brandon Yoder with the double. Five nothing. Line smash caught by Joel Sanchez. Nice play. Gets him out of the inning. Five nothing. Rufex Sports Reach coming up out of the first. Down the line. Gilfillan falls in. Lundensky in left field defensively for Rufex. Brandon Yoder in center. And over there in the right, Arliss Miller. Field defense this game for Rufex is Ryan McClanahan at third. Uh, Logan Rogers at short. Son Kyle Center at pitcher. Fair and Fry at middle. Or second, sorry. Fair and Fry at second. It's uh, Jeremy Fry in the middle. And Tyler Irvine at first with Honeycutt catching. Austin Mapes, second pitch swinging, right center field out there, it's 385. And he's got himself an extra base set. He actually banged his knee into the fence last game, so he's running a little ginger. That's Tyler Kalki at the plate, runners on second and third. Second and third, no outs, Kalki hits it to center, that's in here. Caught by Yoder, run scores, it's five to one. Roncobaldo missed it. Back goes Jeremy Fry. Two out. Oh, Travis Hausman. I didn't think he hit it at first enough. Two run homer for House makes it 5 3. First pitch swing. Joel Sanchez, base hit left field. 
I'll hold them to a single. Dagmar Pena, the batter. Ooh, over Yoder. In the left center, Joel Sanchez is going to score. Make it 5-4. Pena to third with an RBI triple. Rufex major team. Sports reach double A, so it'll be 14 home run limit. You see me zoom in like this during a condensed game? Taking a picture for the reports and the picture album. You can follow on conference, utsa.com, see the tournament reports, rankings, condensed games, video clips, highlights, bloopers, everything. Walk to Andrews. Rufex leads inning one, 5 4. Logan Rogers to the gap. Extra bases. Triple. Lead off triple. We got Brandon Cashwell over there from Bad Draw. He's also one of the sponsors. Stops the order. Arliss Miller tries the right field line. Fair. One run is in. Baron Fry comes around and scores. Good, Mike. Seven four. And Jeremy Fry works the walk after the long foul. Oh, Irvine strikes out looking. Umpire of the year two years ago, Chris Balcazar on the dish for the conference humps. Which Lundensky on the ground as Dagmar Pena kept it in the infield but can't make a play around scores. Sports reach the highest finishing double A tournament in duel number one. They're going to finish at least fourth. Lambright goes to the deepest part of the park. Austin Andrews made an ESPN highlight catch this morning in the stadium. Makes the play here. And a three-pitch walk to Honeycutt. Marshall Grissom out in the field for the conference umps. Patrick Center, you got to get that one good. And Andrews back, climbs the fence, it's gone. Grand slam home run for the pitcher of Rufex. Patrick Kyle Center. Oh, I missed the swing, but Brandon Yoder got it through the left side of the infield. He runs well, even with the 75 foot bases, he's going to get a triple. Joey Camphor catches it, goes through the fence, but holds on. And walk to Kesky to lead it off. Rufex got five in the first, seven in the second. They lead 12-4. Ogle tree, center field, Yoder's out there. No, 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 no. Top of the order, the veteran Jason Gilfillan. Came up with down to earth sports many years ago. A nice catch by Lundensky on the sinking liner. Sports Reach got out the field late last night in the deep in a loser bracket, and then this morning they knocked off uh, Nitro Circus and MPT Juno, Juno Athletics, to get here to the fourth place game. Mapes goes off of center's shin guards, and everybody's safe. Deep left center. Uh, they held Sports Reach to zero. Rufex leads 12 4 to go to the top of the third. One guy felt like they had a block to Rogers. 
All right, let's know a line drive base set. Brad just gonna go first to third. Jeremy Fry walks to load the bases. It's Friday, April 12th, 2024. You can see the Space Coast Stadium off in the distance. Here we have Mark Blazewski pitching to Tyler Irvine. The base is loaded. One hop pass, Joel Sanchez in the 5-6 hole. Two runs are in, Fry to third. And Reflex up 14-4. to the middle, Jeff Kesky with the catch, two outs. Land right, knuckling liner in the left, an RBI single makes it 15 to four. Irvine to third. Rounder to third, Kalki's got it, steps on to the out. Ah, the inning started without me, Rocabaldo. Flies out to left. You can see Rufex has scored a crooked numbers in every inning. They lead Sports Reach 15 4. 75 foot bases, 50 foot pitching rubber, and a line drive homer by Travis Hausman. Get Sports Reach on the board here in the bottom of the third. Dallas, center field. Oh, oh, off the fence. It's Dagmar Pena with the double off the fence. Andrews at the plate. Sports Reach also sponsored by Di Marini. Top of four, Patrick Center had a grand slam last time up. The pitcher stands in. Mooch has been pitching a lot of the games in the winner's bracket. Kyle Center kind of took over here in the loser bracket. Kyle Center walks. Automatic runner for the pitcher over there is Troyer. Brandon Yoder at the plate. Takes a walk, first and second. Walk. I walked him loaded here. One to hop off Kesky's glove. Joel Sanchez backed him up and got the out at second. ConferenceUSA.com for all your major softball articles, videos, links, chat rooms, you name it. Hit and sit show. Fair and Fry at the plate, runners on the corners, 16-5, now 17-5 the lead. And he walks, they're loaded. Looks like Travis Hausman now in left, Camper moved from left to center, Mapes in right, so Austin Andrews came out of the game. Top of the order, Arliss Miller. Miller swung on, deep center. Camphor started across, now goes back. Makes the catch on the warning track. One run's gonna score, here comes Rogers. It's a two run sack fly. And it's 19-5 Rufex. They lost to Sonny's. Or was it Rosmano? I think it was Rosmano. RBI single. Uh, Rufex also sponsored by Pure Bats. Envy. Bad draw. Competitive edge. Irvine got enough there. Nope. Caught. Out of the fence. Ball didn't carry. Alright, Sports Reach also sponsored by Di Marini Bats, Grizzy, and SMHS. To find out what that stands for. Yoder goes back. Makes out number one. Bottom of the fourth. 19 to 5. Rufex. Hey! 
Ozuski missed it. Sports Reach, who played so well this morning against Nitro Circus and MPT, has come out flat against Rufex. Down 19-5, top of the fifth. So Rufex will start trying to push some run rolls. Here's Mitch Lindensky. Tough play for Joel Sanchez, and the lefty runs too well. He's safe. All right, last pitch to Terry Lambright. Runner on first, no outs. Deep right. Mapes goes back, comes in, and makes the catch as the ball died. And he cut through the middle. He's going to score a run to put him up by 15. So Sports Reach will have to score in the bottom of the fifth. Center. Ball's a knuckling. Gone into the net. Two runs shot. Kyle Center right there, number 42. It's your player of the game. He had that grand slam earlier and he's held sports reach to just five runs. Brandon Yoder hits it out. Look out, golf cart. Oh, off the scoreboard. Logan Rogers, basically. Fair and fry with the base set. Arliss Miller, top of the order. Runners on the corners. Jeremy Fry, base is loaded, triple. That should just about put away sports reach here. We had a good run, top double A team in duel number one. Irvine with the walk. Oh, Densky. Oh, it's out, but it's in here. All right, bottom of the fifth, 26 to five, Rufex. Running catch by Lindensky, so they're up, Rufex up 21. I guess that means Sports Reach needs seven. So Rufex has scored 26 on four homers. Sports Reach just two homers, both of them by Travis Hausman. There's Austin Mapes. Swung on center. Back goes Yoder. Leaping and it's out of here. Marshall Grissom, the field. I'm saying Yoder touched that one. So it won't count as a homer on the towards the 14 total that you're allowed. Batter is Parker Strader at a big home run in the seventh inning against Nitro Circus. Sports reach down to their last out. Nice knuckleball by center. And that'll do it. Rufex wins 26-6.